another edition of the Unstoppable Dynamics channel. I am the Unstoppable Dynamics, bringing you guys back another reaction video here on this channel. So today, um, if you guys did not see my video of me uploading Phase Rug reaction video here on this channel, I did a reaction with this guy that was in Phase Rug's video. Um, so I thought I might as well go back to this video where he and phase or talked about um collabing and stuff for one reason and that one reason is because this guy got like a lot of tattoos on his leg saying phase rug phase rug phase rug so yeah let's get in this reaction shall we <sighs> this is not an easy video to make, but I'm just going to keep it short and sweet for you guys. Um, I am the person that is doing the Phase Rug tattoos, trying to meet up with uh, Phase Rug. You know, this all really started as, you know, just a simple fan, you know, just trying to meet one of his favorite influencers. I personally am an influencer. I've been, you know, uh, creating content on YouTube since about 2017. And um, I just... I've been on YouTube since 2011. Well, not on this channel, but literally on my old old channel when i first started um my videos i was on youtube for 2000 since 2011 and i disappeared a couple times and then now i'm here fully making content try to keep doing my thing and just try to grow and you know i just saw this as an opportunity to meet somebody that i truly cared about and have been following since around like 2014 2015 and um what it spiraled into yeah i just don't remember where how long I've been following Phase Rug? I think when a couple of years after me and my ex girlfriend broke up, but yeah, it was I think the same year around that year when I started watching Roman Atwood. It was just crazy, it's just something that I had never really expected to happen. Um, and I just feel very attacked, and um, I just feel like a lot of people won't really see this video. A lot of people won't care. Um, you know, and, and it is what it is. A lot of people don't take the time out of their day to get to know me, but they take the time out of their day to research me on TikTok. Oh, shit. He just had an orb. just went right down his microphone. Did you guys see that? Search me on Instagram and just roast the ever-living shit out of me, which I'm all, I'm all good with. I'm all fine with fun and games, you know, everything. But when I start receiving death threats and people telling me to scrape off my skin, you know, that's... That's literally... One when i first started youtube i had like death threats literally and i i just ignored them and continued doing what i was doing i didn't care we have an issue that's when you know it, it, it gets to a point where it's like damn bro like people really really hate me like i feel like if i see one of these people in real life you know my life is is at, is at jeopardy which is crazy that it had to turn into that um i'm also just trying to d discuss uh thankfully i wore a mask and they don't even know who i look like underneath the mask so they couldn't really you know do anything in person come on being featured on drama alert i feel uh like i was kind of robbed uh, i didn't get to make a statement whatsoever on drama alert and i was just uh made into a laughing stock which again is fine i know what i'm doing is i guess stupid to most people's eyes which which is fine which is completely fine um but you know this all really just started out as me wanting to meet phase rug that's all it ever was and people just are assuming that i want to kill him that i want to do this that i want to do that it's like man i don't even get a chance to speak i don't even get to make a statement i don't even get to, to to reply to these people there's there's thousands of people that hate me there's thousands of people and they don't even know who i am they don't even know how hard i work on my channel how hard i work on my craft and i just feel like you know people exactly. aren't even giving me a chance to just show myself and show what i can do and what i'm capable of i'm not just a fan i'm not just a super fan i'm more than that i'm a person too and to be ridiculed by thousands of people uh, and, and not even get get a chance to defend myself just sucks just sucks like um you know here, here here's the the drama alert you know feature and speaking about influencers and their fan of course it's keem one fan is just a super fan of phase rug to the point where we might find phase rug at the bottom of the lake this tiktoker uploaded a video that he's getting phase rug tattoos which i guess is fine except for he's got 25 of them 
25! And he's gonna keep getting more until he gets to meet Phase Raw. Listen, bro, that's cool and all, but uh, you need to hire extra security. Uh, here's uh, when Phase Raw had uh, DM me. Bro, where do you live? I'm shaking, bro. Glad to hear from you. Dude, we gotta make this happen. So you stop doing my name on your leg. You sure left my ass off? I was having fun. Uh. So, as you can see in that video, I wasn't given the opportunity to make a statement or give my two cents on the matter. Um, considering that I'm the person that's doing all of this, shouldn't I have, like, the right to be able to, you know, say something about everything? He should. You know, and it's crazy the fact that a lot of people will not see this video. A lot of people will not sit down and listen to what I have to say about everything going on. They're just going to keep assuming, just keep talking their shit, which is fine. You know, people, everybody's entitled to their opinions. But when it comes to death threats and everything, man, that is on a whole nother level. But honestly, in that drama alert video, it was just ridiculous some of the stuff that Keemstar was saying. I mean, he was saying that uh, he, he was sort of implying that I, I was trying to hurt Faze Rug. I was trying to, you know... Faze Rug, that he needs to hire more security, you know, completely blowing, blowing this whole situation out of proportion, like any news source really would, you know, like CNN or whoever. And, you know, that's just who Keemstar is. He likes to stretch the truth, and he's just a little bitch. That's that's who he is as a person. I mean, this is the guy. Why not? Why do you fear death? Well, that's what I'm saying. That's, that, it's, it's, it's scary, because if you really think about it, then why live? Just yeah. jump off a cliff. If, if it's just a simulation, who cares? Really? Oh. Regret to inform that this one, I can't pronounce that name has been found keist. Oh, has many people concerned after a recent video call with Keem Star? Bet you. Of course, Keem Star. Good job, Keem. Great job. You're the one who's making everyone die because you're drama sh bullshit. Fuck you, Keemstar. You know what I'm saying? He's talking to a suicidal person like that. Or, I mean, is, isn't this the guy, too? He legitimately went on his show. This motherfucker went on his show. He said he was on antidepressants. And the side effects were that he didn't have feeling in his dick. Such Projection. He was trying to put that on me. Damn. Wow. You know, 40 year old middle aged man just trying to fit in with the youngins, like usual. You know, it is what it is. That's that's all I have to really say about Keemstar. I mean, the guy needs to retire already. I don't know what's going on with him. But all in all, it is no, the. He, he needs not to retire. He needs to stop his bullshit and shut the fuck up and let people live their fucking life and stop dr causing drama. Internet. I know the place of work that I want to be in in the future, and I know the consequences of working in it. Um, you know, I am in no means trying to say that what I'm doing is the best thing ever, and everybody should be on board, and it's not stupid whatsoever. I understand where people are coming from. I understand why people are upset, but I, at the end of the day, man, it's not your body. It's not, you know, exactly. on my face. Uh, I'm not harming anybody. I'm not trying to kill anybody by any means i mean i don't understand where all this shit is coming from you know what i'm saying because it's not coming from me it's not coming from my mouth like people just look at a 30 second 20 second video and want to just you know put their two cents in without even giving the person that made the video you know an opportunity to speak and again that's fine that's the internet well he he wants to cause drama and make people feel bad and end up hurting themselves and yeah because Kim Star is an asshole. That's what I think Kim Star is. Uh, he shouldn't even do fucking drama alert. He should stay out of people's fucking businesses. I already know it. Um, you know, but I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Um, great rest of your night. And if you hate me, I love you. Peace out. Rich, if you're watching this, I, I support you for what you're doing. I have tattoos for my cat. Literally, people say, oh, is it for Burger King? No, this is my cat's initials. My cat's name is Buddy and my last name, okay? And his, is that the day when you go, 
your uh, first burger at Burger King? No. This is his birth date. We're going to finish it when it's t getting close to the end where we have to put him down. And then I got another one of this. This is um, Grim Reaper. And my grandmother don't like this. And does not like this. I have a devil baby on my arm. Literally. My grandmother don't like both of those. Because she's a religious. I'm supposed to be religious. But... I just don't have time to go to church and don't have time just to sit there and listen to the same crap over and over and over again every freaking week. Um, literally. That's what they pretty much do. And they, after they talk, I mean, do their usual, they start getting off topic where then they start talking like, no, we're supposed to be at church. I know you want to tell your story and shit, but come on. But anyways, guys, um, I'm going to be back with another video of Rich. Um, Rich, if you're watching this, I will be doing another video. Um, and I will do be probably doing some more videos of yours coming soon. Um, if you want, um, guys, please subscribe if you're a fan of Rich. Um... This channel is actually growing and growing every time I do new um, reaction videos. So, thank you guys for watching. Hit that notification bell so that way guys do not miss an upload here on this channel. If you want um, me to react to any kind of videos from other YouTubers. Like, say, for instance, um, Keemstar Drama Alert. Let me know in the comments below. Leave a link down in the uh, comments below. I'm unstoppable, and I'll see you guys in the next reaction. And I'm out. Hey, everybody. It's your boy, Skiz, here. And if you don't subscribe to, to Buon and the Unstoppable Denominator, then you are a toothy, bumfuck, pussy-ass bitch motherfucker.